all signs tarot this is a daily love reading for the sign of libra for the 28th of march 2022 holy spirit show me the libras who need to hear these messages today let's see da -da -da. knight of swords okay libra you are gonna communicate something and it might be very direct and abrupt about your feelings that are very powerful feelings you're going uh, straight for the kill here so you're you're not gonna beat around the bush you're gonna tell somebody that you love them who is the person you're telling you love them who is this person who are you declaring your love to let's see let's see because i've got lots of cards here on the floor so we've got six of pentacles knight of cups reversed okay this person may have um offered you love in the past possibly and they're taking it back i don't know this person might not take the cup from you, actually, because you see Knight of Swords is taking the cup to the Knight of Cups, but the Knight of Cups is in reverse. Six of Pentacles, you might want to to kind of like e even the score, settle the score with this person. I don't know why I said that, because you see, it, it looks like they're jousting with each other. There's two knights, you know, going towards each other, but this one's in reverse. So this one's like they put their feelings to the side. Right? And now you, the Knight of Swords, have the feelings here. You have the cup instead of the Knight of Cups. So maybe it's like um, this person gave you the cup and you ran away with it. Now you're coming back with the cup. This person doesn't have a cup for you anymore. So it's like you ran away with this person's heart. And now you're going back to this person to kind of like make amends here. But I don't think this person will take the cup. I'm not sure. With the Four of Swords here, this person might ghost you. They might ignore you. Two of Pentacles. This person might be focusing on something else. Maybe this person is in another relationship now. Or they, they're going to be juggling you. They're, they're going to be juggling whether they want to talk to you or not. So they might leave you on red here for a while. Eight of Swords. Is this person going to take your cup? 75 could be significant. Somebody could be born in 1975. Also the 7th of May or the 5th of July could be significant. The 5th of July is in cancer season. This could be a cancer that you're dealing with. Also they might have um, Taurus in their chart. Right. Or Capricorn. So this person's yeah, like I said, they're going to leave you out in the cold. They're going to leave you waiting. Seven of Pentacles. The guy's waiting out in the cold. Yeah, this person's not going to let you in. This person could have been very open to you emotionally in the past. Especially if this is a cancer. They could have been very giving, very loving, very uh, love bombing. I don't know. <laughs> but it's like um, they lost their cup for you. Like you took it. You took their heart and ran away. So now they don't have a heart anymore. I swear to God, that's what I'm seeing here. I'm sorry, but that's the message for somebody. I don't know if you're a man or a woman, but uh, that's what happened here with this cancer or this earth sign here that you're dealing with. Something flipped in my deck, but I don't know what. Maybe look this way. I don't know. It went back in. Anyway. So... Yeah, this person's gonna leave you out in the cold. Is there anything you can do to make amends with this person, to uh, reconcile with this person? Is there anything Libra can do to reconcile with this person? Eight of Pentacles, Nine of Wands. You need to keep um, working on yourself. You need to keep trying. Don't give up. Because I think this person might take you back eventually if they see that you're willing to put in effort and energy towards them. Nine of Swords. Hmm. So if you put in an effort, how is this person going to react? And what kind of effort should you be putting in? I don't know. They need to, probably they need to see that you have staying power, that you're serious about them. Four of Wands. They, they need to see stability here with the Four of Wands. Ten of Wands. Uh, there's a lot of karma between you and this person from the past. There's um, You're burdened by the karma that you have with this person. Maybe both of you have karma. I don't know. But you... Uh, it's like, I'm sorry, but whoever this is for, this is the bad guy. The Libra is the bad guy in this situation, so to speak. Nine of Cups. Okay, there will be a wish fulfillment here. 
once you drop these burdens from the past but this person needs to see change actual change that change has actually happened in order to take you back right look five of wands there's a lot of conflict here you could have had a lot of conflicts with this person so is there what what can you do to um make this come back together if you want it so bad all this stuff came out let's see Look, the Five of Wands came out again. Seven of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, Three of Swords, Queen of Swords. Okay, if you have anyone else on the side, you need to let go of that third party. Maybe this person is guarded towards you because they know that you still have somebody. Or that's why you separated from this person. You could have um, cheated on this person. You could have blocked them. And um, you could have blocked this person and then kind of... Um, bragged about your new relationship yeah you could have left this person for another person and made it look um made them feel like shit basically yeah i think that's what happened here six of wands you were in your ego here with the six of wands eight of cups knight of wands so you walked away from this person very victorious and uh you cheated on them and you left them for somebody else that's what i'm seeing here yes it's true i'm afraid so this is the situation here so it's going to be hard for you to actually get this person back you would really have to kind of like jump through hoops about it so i don't know if this is necessarily a good idea maybe it's better to just let this person go and find somebody else should you put in an effort it came out in reverse see the flowers in reverse king of wands reversed I'm hearing the sirens outside. King of Wands reverse. The King of Wands is somebody who takes a lot of action, right? But in reverse, is like you shouldn't put any effort into this because it's kind of pointless. Yeah, it is. Um, I think there's too much damage that's been done already. All this stuff wants to come out. Let's see. Yes, it's true. King of Swords is true. Too much damage has been done already. Four of Pentacles. Hold hold back. Keep it to yourself. I don't know. Ten of Cups. Knight of Pentacles. Look at that. That's interesting here. You might get a new relationship here. Possibly with somebody else. Who is the new relationship here? Who are you going to get into a new relationship with? Yeah, you should hold back from this person and pursue somebody else, I think. There's more chances of having a happy relationship with somebody else. So who is this new person? Who is the person you're supposed to have this happy relationship with? Five of Cups reversed. Somebody you don't have to apologize to. Okay? Somebody whose heart you haven't broken. Yeah, so it's better to just cut your losses, let this person go and find somebody else, right? Because this could be your karma in this relationship. Your karma is that you cannot come back to this person because you've hurt them too much. So if you let them go, you can let go of your karma. But you can let go of your karma only if you let this person go. Because if you keep pursuing this person, you're just going to cause more karma. So if you want to get rid of the karma, you just need to let the person go. Of course, that is your karma and the fact that you're losing the person. But on the other hand, you can get something better after you've let them go okay so yeah new person new beginning that's the message i have for libra i hope this helps take care